in Hana, we have uh, an award named Wookie of the Year. The Wookie of the Year is a nurse that has been in Hana for less than a year, but yet has made a tremendous impact. And the, the Wiki of the Year for 2013 is Marjorie Williams. Next, we have the President Choice Awards. Um, the President Choice Awards are those individuals that has gone above and beyond, not only to help Hannah, but as well to make sure that the leadership of Hannah succeed. And um, the Presidential Choice Awards are Jeff Lozama. Mr. Lozama is one of our faithful advisors. <laughs> Mr. Lozama, as an advisor, has gone above and beyond for Hannah. I want you to know that we value you. The next President Choice Award is Gregory Lamour. <laughs> Gregory Lamour is one of our volunteers that has gone above and beyond for Hannah. And Gregory, I thank you. Gregory, I thank you and Hannah values you. Next Presidential Choice Award, Nadine Bawo. Nadine Bawo is one of the nurses that has been with Hannah for many years and has gone above and beyond. Thank you, Nadine. Next President's Choice Award goes to Representative Daphne Campbell for making a difference in the nursing profession. She must have left. Um, the next President's Choice Award will go to no other than my mother, Elsie Sauvage. My mom, over the past two years of my leadership, has gone above and beyond for Hannah by coming to my house when I'm going to Haiti to babysit. My daughter was having an asthma attack. I left because I know my daughter was in great hands. Thank you, mommy. I love you. Thank you for sharing me with Hannah.
um, the last, oh, we have the Hana Wall of Fame. Hana Wall of Fame will be, I mean, is given to Miss Gislaine Pepewala. She has made a great contribution to Hana. She was president twice. What does that tell you? She's a woman who has backbone. She's a potomita. Mrs. Gislaine Pepewala, can you please come forward? Representative Daphne Campbell, you are also one of our President's Choice Award for your contribution to the nursing profession. Thank you. The last award is the Nurse of the Year Award. Nurse of the Year for 2013. This particular nurse is a nurse that, of course, all of our nurses in HANA has gone above and beyond. But this particular nurse really goes above and beyond. Um, she's committed, she's dedicated. Not only she's dedicated to HANA, to HANA's leadership, but also she's also dedicated to the community. Um, the nurse of the year for 2013 is Pauline Louis Magist. And of course, in HANA, because we have so many dedicated nurses, we just couldn't have just a nurse of the year. Our other nurse of the year is Miss Angelique Antoine. Ahana is blessed to have yet another great leader. I am honored to pass on the torch to one of the greatest persons who, whom I am confident will continue the legacy of Hannah. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand and help me welcome our new dynamic leader for 2013-2015, Mrs. Marjorie Lozama. Good evening again. It is with honor, great optimism, and humility that I accept my presidency.
For the past two years, I serve as second vice president and perform my duties with great pride and joy. For nearly four years, I worked diligently to uphold the standards of the organization, and I'm confident with your support, I will continue to achieve Hannah's endeavors. I am honored and excited to represent that this distinguished body of over 500 Haitian American nurses. I'd like to give a special thanks to the founding members who have worked diligently to sustain the mission and vision of this organization with compassion, dedication, hard work, and commitment. As I step into my new and exciting role, I would like to first congratulate President Neilville and her board for their outstanding leadership and great achievements. And I tell you, President Neilville has left big shoes to fill, and tonight I'm blessed that I'm a size 10. <laughs> I would like to share with you my vision. It's to engage and empower the members to be effective agents of change in the community. The Institute of Medicine report calls on nurses to lead change and advance health. Therefore, nurses need to remain proactive and embrace this evolving healthcare system. To lead change effectively, we, nurses, in addition to caring, caring for patients, families, and communities, must remain engaged in the process to inspire others to get involved. To achieve my goals, we will continue the effort of the past board by enhancing Hannah's Leadership Institute, which goal is to empower and mentor nurses to seek higher education and assume leadership positions across all levels in the nursing profession. We will attempt to provide the same leadership opportunities to nurses in Haiti by creating a new committee entitled the Internal, International Affairs Committee, which objectives are to address higher nursing education and reinforce the use of evidence-based practice in nursing. Nurses, we are given the responsibility to lead change and advance health. I am challenging you tonight to renew your commitment to join forces with me to find creative ways to reach newer heights, and most importantly, to cultivate future nurse leaders. To achieve this goal, all of us, have the responsibility to get involved in the affairs of the association. In HANA, we are known for strength, commitment, dedication, compassion, caring, creativity, and hard work. And then we will rise to the challenge as long as we remain united. I'm asking right now all my fellow nurses to please stand. Nurses, 
Please remain standing, please, please, please. Nurses, now it is our time to seize the moment and opportunity to work together and uphold the standards of our profession. Together we will succeed. Nurses, are you ready to lead change and advance health? Thank you. Please be seated. I would like to introduce to you the 2013-2015 Executive Board members. First Vice President, Lisa Francois Lovanis. Second Vice President, Angelique Antoine. Treasurer Marjorie Salomon. <laughs> Assistant Treasurer Pauline Louis Magist. <laughs> Secretary Nathalie Jean Michel. Last but not least, Assistant Secretary Marsha Eloy. I would like for Honorable Joyce Serafin to please join us for the induction of a new board. Good evening, everyone. If I can take a moment and congratulate Hannah. You guys are. Uh, one of the proudest organizations that I know of. And I want also to congratulate the honorees. And congratulations, Calvin. You are truly, truly a friend of the Haitian people. And I thank you for that. It's an honor for me to accept to do this. I, I think I am part of Hannah. I've, I've known you guys for a long time. But I take this very seriously, and I hope you do also, which is why I come out uh, to lend some credibility to this process. But you guys, mm -hmm. I salute your courage because you've stepped up. As I understand, it can be lonely at the top. So I salute your courage. In the meantime, if you can please be so kind as to raise your right hand to be sworn. And repeat after me. I state your name. Do solemnly swear or affirm that I will support, protect, and defend Hannah, that I will uphold the bylaws of Haitian American Nurses Association. That I am duly qualified to hold office, to hold office. under the bylaws. Under the bylaws. That, I that I will promote and support, and support the, best the best interests of Haitian nurses, of Haitian nurses wherever, situated. wherever situated. That I will well and faithfully, and faithfully perform the duties of my office, so help me God. Congratulations, ladies. almost there, I promise. Um, my, my, President Mirville, 
She has been a wonderful, dynamic, charismatic leader. And I'm so glad that I'm taking over right after her. Um, she's loving mother of two, dedicated, and she has the biggest heart. And then I was, I'm so proud to have served under your leadership. And I love you. Please come up and accept this beautiful plaque from Hannah. Well, get ready to dance. Thank you for coming tonight. And I hope to see you on the news at 5, 5.30, 6, and 11 o'clock. Let's give it up for New Look. New Look is going to provide the entertainment tonight. I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for coming. Safe travel. Elle va de prison, 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 el